Hey, welcome back AutoCAD students. And in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to export your CUIX file, which is your customized workspace file. Okay, so that you can take this workspace and import it onto another computer. All right, so in order to export this, I'm going to come down to the command line and I'm going to actually type in CUI export. All right, and that brings us up into the customized user interface with the transfer tab uh, open. All right, so next thing I'm going to do is pull this menu down and I'm going to click on save as. All right, and what you can do here is you can navigate to where you want to save this particular uh, CUIX file, CJD CUIX, and it will give it the extension of CUIX. So let's pick save. Okay, and we're going to just pick apply and OK, and we've now exported the CUI file. Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to import your CUI into a new AutoCAD program or on a new computer. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually type in on the command line CUI import. Okay. And that brings us here to this same dialog box. On the left hand side, I'm going to go to this pull down and I'm going to pick open. And you're going to navigate to where your CUIX file is. So here's my CUIX file. I'm going to pick open. And notice over here that this is the custom CUIX file. Okay. So what I'm going to want to do is I'm going to want to take this workspace and I'm going to drag it over to the main CUI file, which is right here. Okay. Um, and I'm going to just take a look at my toolbars to see if it added my custom toolbar. Yep, CJD toolbar. And here it, here it is. It did add it. That's part of that, that file. Okay. And now I'm just going to right click on this and set it to be the current workspace. Okay. So now this is my current workspace. I'm going to pick apply and I'm going to pick OK. All right. And here now notice that I've got the other two the other two toolbars and my custom toolbar that I had in that CJD workspace, okay? So that's how you import a CUI from a saved uh, export that you did previously. I hope that helps until the next tutorial. I hope you can give that a try.